So we're at the uh, Eagleville Community Center, and Mark is going to take us on a tour of the pre prep barbecue, massive, this is a huge barbecue, the Eagleville barbecue that, uh, that uh, is for the fire department in Eagleville, and he's going to give us a rundown of this whole conveyor belt that they're getting ready for the barbecue. We're here because of Earth's alone. Anyway, we'll okay. start this end over here. They kill the cow right outside the door, then they soak it in a creek for 24 hours. That was according to Mrs. No. Mrs. Terry, yes, sir. No, no, no. No? What they do is they get the food to me here. You see him cutting it up. We've got spicers here. They got a mix of spices, vegetables, pepper. They wrap all of the meat. They wrap all of the meat in these paper with the vegetables and you come on down mark come on you, gotta, you don't really don't know what they're doing do you no i do okay so it comes in it's soaked overnight in a creek no that's not right okay he, he didn't get that right so the meat has not been soaked in a creek they're prepping it they're spicing it they're wrapping it in vegetables Wrapped up in vegetables. They bring it down here. And they wrap it in the burlap. No. They wrap it in the vegetables. Then they wrap it up in burlap. Watch these guys tie the knots. And then, after it's wrapped up in the burlap, they have a sip of beer, a couple sips of beer, maybe a can of beer, possibly between between wraps. <laughs> and they wrap it in the burlap. Been doing this for 65 minutes? Yes, 65 years, and Ed Barrios has been taking it. They're tying it up. face with a ball of meat. <laughs> chuck it to him, chuck it down there, it goes out the door, and then you take it to a creek, a creek, and they soak it overnight, and then they throw it, well, we'll get to that tomorrow, what they actually do with it.